Hi, okay, this is video number six for howtotwittertutorial.com. Uh, you can find this with all the other videos on howtotwittertutorial.com. What we're going to look at in this video is how you can check out or how you can be aware of who's talking about you, your company, your website, your product, your brand, or your service on Twitter. Okay, now there's obviously a lot of conversations going on on Twitter all the while. How on earth are you going to find out if your company or your name uh, or your product is being talked about? Well, there's a very easy way. There's actually a service called TweetBeep. So let's go and have a look at that. Here's the site. It's TweetBeep.com. So first thing to do is head over to TweetBeep.com and sign up for a free account. It is free for the basic account. Now the basic account allows you to track up to 10 keywords. That should be most uh, should be enough for most people. Um, if you want to go above 10 words, there is the option to upgrade. I believe the premium account is $20 a month, where you can have up to 200 alerts. I think there's a, a medium level as well in between that. Um, but as I say, 10 will probably do for most people. So go and sign up for free. Once you've signed up, log in, and you'll see a page like this. Okay, now what I'm going to do is click on new keyword alert. I've already got one set up with my own name. I'm going to add a new one. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in the name of one of my other websites and products. Okay, so that's one of my products and websites. I'm going to simply copy that. I'm going to put the alert name as the same as the keyword that I actually want to track um, just to make it simple, keep life easy. Okay, now there are lots of other options here, including things like excluding words, uh, hashtags, different languages, whether it's from different people or to different people. So there's all sorts of things you can do with this if you want to play around and get sophisticated. But personally, I keep it nice and simple and just track alerts for a particular keyword or a couple of keywords uh, so that I can pick up all the different conversations that are going on. Now the frequency, normally I just go for every day. Um, if it was something that I was expecting some buzz about, if I was launching a new product uh, or something like that, then I might go for every hour so that as it starts, as buzz starts going, as a conversation starts, I can jump in and join in the conversation. But for most of them, I just go for a daily update so I can see what's going on at the end of the day. Okay, that's it. That's how easy it is to set up a new alert. Now if I scroll down, and if I move this page up a bit, the last thing we need to do is click on Save Alert, and that's it done. We now have a new TweetBeep alert set up for IM ad swaps, and that will now send us a daily digest of all the mentions of that particular keyword on Twitter. Okay, very useful. Now let's have a quick look at a couple of examples. Um, this is one from earlier in the year that I saved so I could use this as a particular example. This is when I was tracking obviously my own name uh, and this is a, a lady called Nicola Cairncross who's mentioned me uh, with regard to a workshop that I was going to and obviously said something favourable uh, about the workshop so thank you Nicola. Um, so I was able to actually reply to her and thank her for that comment and that was because I spotted it through this tweet beep. I'm not on Twitter all day every day and this is a way of making sure that I don't miss anything that's important. Now the next mention is not me, it's a different Matt Garrett. You will find if you use your own name, there are probably a few other people out there with the same name as you. Um, but at the time, I think I did have a look at the Earl just to make sure that it wasn't me being referenced for some reason, and it wasn't. And the next two down there, Matt Garrett and Matt Garrett again, are to do with a, an article on resume writing tips. That happens that that is me. It's an article I wrote three or four years ago and submitted to an article directory. And it's still out there. It's still being spread around the internet. It's still getting me traffic. So it does show that article marketing can work. And again, I can see that because I can see my name popping up as the author of this article that people are mentioning. Okay. The other example, uh, this is one that came in earlier today, and again, three mentions of Matt Garrett. None of them happy, uh, happen to be me, so I know that nothing's going on that I need to check out uh, with regard to my own name today, uh, and I can leave it at that. Okay. Most of the time when you get these alerts, you can quickly skim through, and you know that you need to do nothing about it. You're not missing anything, no problem. But if there is something important to do with your brand name, your product name, your own name, you can catch it, you can get involved in the conversation and support people who are spreading your name uh, and giving you good buzz, 
or answer any questions, etc. Okay, so very, very useful. Also, it's great in that it's free for up to 10. So I'd highly recommend jumping over to TweetBeep and signing up for your free account now. Okay, this video, as I said, is on howtotwittertutorial.com along with a whole bunch of other free Twitter tutorial videos. Thank you very much for watching.